now we ended up with a tremendous scale of spatial scale. Je mi këtu me profesor Viktor Ashak, profesor biologie nga Universiteti i Maltës, pjesmarës në konferencën ndërkomtare të ekosistemit të deteve dhe bregteteve. We are here with profesor Viktor Ashak, representing Malta, profesor of biology from the University of Malta. Professor, how important is the conservation and the ecosystem of the Mediterranean Sea um, from uh, your country point of view? Yeah. We, Malta is in the middle of the Mediterranean and we are very, very aware of the problems that, we, that the Mediterranean can face. Um, Malta, as I said in my presentation this morning, is like a microcosm um, presenting uh, all the problems and all the um, uh, opportunities that the Mediterranean can, the Mediterranean environment can offer. There are in the Mediterranean and which we have all to, to tackle as regards both climate change, uh, marine life, uh, all these uh, marine life especially represents a source of um, wealth in terms of tourism uh, which we need to to appreciate and we need to protect this morning um, we've heard about um, how how important it is to protect wetlands um, uh, not just in in uh, you know, in Albania, for example, we have some very important wetlands. Uh, and we also talked about how important is deep sea um, communities. The, um, we think that the, the, the in the deep sea, um, we had a French colleague talking about um, the amount of life, the richness of life that we can find in very, very deep seas uh, in the world's ocean and how little we know of them and if only when we can appreciate them and we, if only we can protect them properly uh, before we lose them. The, in Albania there are different uh, associations and movements, um, uh, especially this year, trying to promote uh, tourism. Uh, uh, for example, uh, Le Visias Chipriare is uh, um, uh, trying um, to do this promotion in different cities with, uh, um, you know, with uh, uh, the project Welcome to Albania. Do you think it's very important, uh, um, this activity, on uh, the connection with tourism? Yes, I think that um, tourism and the tourist industry, um, and w w people are realizing that tourists try to visit places uh, which are apart from being clean and unpolluted, which can offer an authentic experience. Um, uh, so it is very important that Albania, Malta or any other place which is at, uh, trying to attract tourists, it's I think very, very important to appreciate what they have uh, from the point of view of culture, from the point of view of marine life and uh, of um, biodiversity, because those are the things which tourists try to, to appreciate themselves. If tourists uh, visit a place which is simply like any other place uh, along the Mediterranean, uh, they will not be attracted uh, enough to come for a second time. Uh, thank you. Ishim Prame Professor Viktor Ashak, it's Ilifoli in Birensin, ecosystemit, biodiversitetit, the Birensin, Cheka, Kyo, Nelidia, me turismin, Sichesh Pershemu, Tanina Shipri, Fushata, welcome to Albania, Levisia Shipri Are. Dhe të kemi një vend sa më të pasër dhe sa më të bukur, kjo ju intereson turistve. Falim dirit. Um, we are here with Mr. Götz Flözer, uh, representing the um, institution of Helmholtz Center from Germany. Uh, you have taken part in this international, co international conference of ecosystem of marines. Uh, what experiences you bring here from Germany in this uh, conference? Well, uh, we have the Institute of Coastal Research in Germany. It's in North Germany, not very far from the city of Hamburg, and we are building up in this institute um, observational system for the North Sea. And this observational system consists of many instruments, many different instruments, fixed stations, stations installed on ships passing through the North Sea, and satellite communication and modeling and many others. And uh, we thought something of that could perhaps be inter um, interesting for the coastal areas of Albania. 
uh, Germany has um, very good and uh, nice experiences. And do you think, um, uh, from your impressions to Albania, do you think they are um, uh, good to, to be adapted uh, from uh, our country? Not all of them, of course. But uh, I, to give you an example, we have developed an instrument called the Ferry Box. And this is a, a water analysis device installed on ships that go in a regular course. So, for example, if we uh, take the ferry going from Albania to Brindisi or Bari and install a ferry box there, then we could have a water analysis um, uh, covering the entire um, Adriatic Sea. So we could uh, calculate what happens in the Adriatic Sea um, and, and we, we, could, we could make these measurements. This would be one example and it would not be Albania alone but it would be in close cooperation with Italian partners. And this has more, um, uh, perhaps we ha you have more success then in order to establish um, Albanian monitoring system for your coast. Uh, organizing an international conference here in Tirana about these topics, it means that Albania is trying to do the best and trying to take seriously uh, the ecosystem of marines. Do you think this is a, a good step on the integration of Alba Albania in uh, uh, Europe? It's absolutely necessary yeah, and I'm very happy that I'm um, I'm here for this uh, first conference of this kind in Albania. I was invited by Saimir Becerai. Um, I met him four years ago when he was in Germany and participated in a summer school which I organized. So, and he, there he addressed me and asked me uh, perhaps about some cooperation in the future. So that means I was there at the very first moment. Uh, he was thinking about this conference and I'm happy that, that I can help some in, in, in whatever way, so my, maybe technical support, maybe advice in some kind uh, of establishing um, cooperation. I gave him some hints uh, for some Italian partners uh, who may be helpful in development and observational system for the Albanian coast. So it is absolutely ne necessary to have this international cooperation and the European Union as you perhaps know funds also countries that are not members of the European Union. Albania or Israel or Norway or several other countries. So this would could be a good opportunity for Albania. You are coming as a representative of Helmholtz Center. Is it a governmental institution? Uh, can you say something about um, how Germany and the government looks uh, look to Albania? <laughs> no, I have not the experience here. Uh, our our uh, research center is with about a thousand um, employees is a government funded. 90% of the money comes from the German Ministry of Re uh, Research and Education. Okay, But um, I do not know up to now about any official cooperation in this respect between Germany and Albania. I don't think there is one. Maybe the presentation type of major coastal engineering works, monitoring and management of environmental impact and risks. Mr. Chairman. Um, so, uh, Malta and Mediterranean <coughs> and Marinas. Um, you know, coastal tourism in the Mediterranean is extremely important. And I suppose um, I don't need to say this even to, to my colleagues in Albania. Um, uh, some, some countries, say like um, Monaco, for example, um, uh, they really depend on the way their coastal tourism is um, proceeding. Um, of course, the same thing can uh, can be said to place for the timetable of the program. But anyway, you are welcome to make questions.
then takes us to the next presentation prepared by Sarah Dallachi, titled Protection, Management and Development of Mare, and also run for correlated data Please. Hello, everybody. Lena seems to be a very interesting region, so <laughs> we have a lot of presentation about this. Uh, my presentation is uh, related to protection, management, and development of the marine and coastal environment of Leja district. Um, okay, my colleagues show uh, only uh, the area of uh, the lagoon, Kulimbari, but uh, Leja is uh, in the northwestern part of Albania. It's a very interesting region. Uh, the marine and coastal areas, uh, the marine and coastal area is uh, richly endowed with important resources for promotion of tourism. Uh, there is a, a very important beach, section Mini Beach and uh, Tide Beach. Uh, Deja is uh, well now for fishery, aquaculture and industry. And this is during uh, summer. Increase of population uh, of pollution level. This is a, a big problem of this area because uh, uh, of lack of pollution and the water pollution. You can see. Thank you for thank you also. And. Uh,